Another delay for the highly anticipated Talos Resort development in La Quinta. As News Channel 3's Jeff Stahl uncovered, the project, formerly known as Silver Rock, is no longer on track for a planned opening next fall. Talos construction continues, but not on pace to finish by its latest promised timeline for the city. The city is absolutely committed to this project and we still stand behind it very firmly. Uh, we're going to hold the developer responsible uh, for any of these delays, missing these milestones that he's had. The Talos website promises a development of two luxury branded hotels, a spa, a conference center, golf and private residences just off Avenue 50 east of downtown. But the city posted a notice on its Talos website Wednesday saying the Robert Green Company is retooling its financing to keep the project economically viable. They're blaming higher construction costs for a six to eight month project delay. You said the city is still committed and the, and you're confident that the developer is still committed. I'm absolutely confident. He's got a hundred and over a hundred million dollars invested in it at this point. And uh, I'm sure there's not a developer out there that wants to leave that money on the table. The city confirms what we've heard from contractors that construction slowed in September. Talos was recently rebranded from its old Silver Rock name, a name already associated with numerous delays. Now the city says the developer's announcement is a disappointment, but not all in all a surprise as both interest rates and inflation have sent the project's costs soaring. The higher price tags are reflected in higher labor, materials and equipment costs. That combined with the interest rates have really hampered his progress. Any questions for Bruce? Developers haven't given the city a public update on the project since mid-July when they said all was going well. They now say that they have already resecured two key financing elements, bringing $48 million into the residential construction phase. Other components are expected to be secured in the coming weeks for $290 million. In La Quinta, for the I-Team, Jeff Stahl, News Channel 3. Now we have calls and emails into the Robert Green Company for comment, but have not received a response from them beyond those already published on the city's website that we continue to overcome the challenges faced by our industry that have hampered our progress, but will never diminish our resolve to complete this world-class project. Stay with News Channel 3 for any new developments.